Hey there! Have you ever wondered why some individuals, despite being a part of the crowd, manage to stay detached and unscathed by unwanted attention? These folks are what we call Sigma males. Now imagine a person who's an introverted alpha, someone who's self-reliant and independent, a person who doesn't need validation from others, yet exudes an air of quiet confidence. That's a Sigma male for you. These individuals are often misunderstood because they prefer solitude over socializing. They're not antisocial, they're selectively social. They are the lone wolves, the wanderers, the mavericks who don't conform to societal norms. They have an unconventional style that sets them apart, making them an enigma. Yet this mysterious aura often attracts unwanted attention. But how do Sigma males deal with this? Well, it's not by changing their nature or conforming to expectations. It's by staying true to themselves. Now let's delve into how these Sigma males handle unwanted attention, which is often a byproduct of their mysterious aura. Sigma males have mastered the art of avoidance, which helps them escape unnecessary attention. But how do they do it? Well, the answer lies in their strategies, which are as intricate as the minds that employ them. Sigma males are the masters of keeping a low profile. They're not the ones you'll find at the center of a party basking in the spotlight. No, they're more likely to be found on the outskirts, observing the spectacle rather than participating. They're the shadows in the room, unnoticed yet fully aware. Their preference for the sidelines isn't a sign of timidity. Rather, it's a strategic move. By choosing not to draw attention to themselves, they remain in control of their narrative. They're able to move through life without the burden of others' expectations or judgments. It's their way of preserving their independence and personal space. Avoidance for Sigma males is not about fear or insecurity. It's about valuing their privacy and peace above the fleeting allure of public recognition. They're not interested in the game of social dominance. They'd rather play by their own rules. They understand that the spotlight often comes with strings attached. Strings that can bind and restrict their freedom. They'd rather be free in the shadows than chained in the spotlight. Sigma males also know that avoidance isn't just about physical presence. It's also about the energy they project. They carry an aura of unavailability that subtly discourages unwanted attention. It's not an off-putting vibe, but one that signifies self-sufficiency and contentment in their own company. This energy acts as a shield, deflecting any unsolicited intrusions into their personal space. While avoidance is one strategy, it's not the only way Sigma males deal with unwanted attention. Let's explore this further. Sigma males are not just masters of avoidance, but they also wield the power of silence. But how does silence help them deflect unwanted attention? Welcome to the realm of silence, a territory often misunderstood yet masterfully utilized by Sigma males. In a world where everyone is clamoring to be heard, silence is a refreshing deviation. Silence for Sigma males is not just the absence of noise, it's a strategic tool, a cloak of invisibility they don to navigate through the social labyrinth. Now you might wonder, how does silence help divert attention? Imagine being at a party where everyone is trying to outdo each other with their tales, their jokes, their opinions. Then there's this one person quietly observing, hardly saying a word. Intriguing, isn't it? But here's the twist. The Sigma male's silence doesn't invite curiosity. It deflects it. It's a paradox, but it works. Silence gives Sigma males the power to control conversations. When they do speak, their words carry weight because they are not generously scattered. They choose when to engage, what to reveal, and how much to share. This selective communication makes them hard to read, shrouded in mystery, and less likely to attract unwanted attention. Keeping their thoughts to themselves, Sigma males become a canvas onto which others project their assumptions. The less they reveal, the more others fill in the blanks, often erroneously. This misdirection is another way Sigma males use silence to divert attention. It's like they're playing a game of chess, and silence is their queen, the most powerful piece on the board. However, silence is not about being aloof or disinterested. It's a conscious choice, a sign of self-assuredness. 
Sigma males understand that not every question needs an answer, not every argument needs participation, and not every spotlight needs to be stepped into. They understand the value of listening over speaking, observing over performing. Silence is a powerful tool, but it's not the only one in the Sigma male's arsenal for dealing with unwanted attention. As we delve deeper into the enigmatic world of Sigma males, we'll discover more of these tools and the unique ways they navigate through life's social mazes. Stay tuned. Another weapon in the Sigma male's arsenal is indifference. But how does indifference help them ward off unwanted attention? Let's dive into this fascinating aspect. Sigma males are masters of indifference. They don't just use it as a tool, they live it. It's their way of being, their lifestyle. They're not swayed by external stimuli, and this remarkable trait makes them less appealing to attention seekers. After all, it's hard to get a rise out of someone who just doesn't care. Indifference is a shield, a protective barrier. The Sigma male doesn't react, doesn't engage, doesn't indulge in the drama. He's aloof, detached, and that makes him incredibly hard to read. This unpredictability, this enigma is what throws people off. They can't figure him out, they can't predict his reactions, and that makes him a less interesting target. Imagine this scenario. You're throwing pebbles at a lake, hoping to create ripples. But instead of ripples, there's just a calm, unbroken surface. That's the Sigma male. He's the lake that doesn't ripple. He absorbs the impact, remains unruffled, and that's incredibly frustrating for those seeking a reaction. But it's not just about being unreactive. The Sigma male's indifference is also about preserving his energy, his peace of mind. He's selective about what he allows into his sphere, what he gives his time and attention to. He's not interested in petty squabbles or trivial pursuits. He's focused on his path, his goals, and he won't let anything or anyone derail him. So how does he achieve this state of indifference? It's not something he's born with. It's a conscious choice, a carefully cultivated mindset. It's about learning to let go of things that don't serve him, things that drain his energy. It's about understanding that not every battle needs to be fought, not every provocation needs a response. Indifference, silence, and avoidance are all tools that Sigma males use to deal with unwanted attention. But what's the underlying philosophy behind these tactics? Well, it's simple. The Sigma male lives by his own rules, sets his own boundaries, and he won't let anyone cross them. It's about respect, self-preservation, and most importantly, maintaining control over his own life. At the heart of the Sigma male's strategies for dealing with unwanted attention is a philosophy of non-engagement. This philosophy is not a result of apathy or disdain for others, but rather a conscious choice made with a clear understanding of one's own priorities and values. It's about conserving their energy for things that truly matter to them and not squandering it on unnecessary social interactions or drama. The Sigma male knows that every interaction, every conversation, every debate has a cost. It's not just about time, but also about mental and emotional energy. And so, they make a deliberate choice to engage only in those interactions that are meaningful and rewarding. This doesn't mean they're antisocial or unapproachable. On the contrary, when a Sigma male chooses to engage, they are fully present and deeply invested. They listen, they empathize, they contribute, but they do so selectively, focusing on quality over quantity. The philosophy of non-engagement also extends to their dealings with drama and conflict. The Sigma male is the master of sidestepping unnecessary conflict, of not getting drawn into petty squabbles or power games. They see the drama for what it is, a drain on their energy and a distraction from their path and they choose to step away. It's important to understand that this is not about avoidance or escapism. It's about making a conscious choice to not engage in situations that do not serve their purpose. It's about recognizing that not every battle is worth fighting, not every conflict is worth resolving, and not every attention is worth acknowledging. This is the philosophy of non-engagement. It's not about being passive or indifferent, but about being discerning and intentional. It's about understanding one's own boundaries and respecting them. It's about choosing one's battles wisely and understanding that sometimes the most powerful response is no response at all. So, the Sigma male's ability to handle unwanted attention is not just about strategies, but also about a deeply ingrained philosophy of life. So, 
What can we learn from Sigma males and their approach to handling unwanted attention? Well, we've unraveled the enigma of the Sigma male, a character often overlooked but brimming with quiet strength. Sigma males master the art of avoidance, not out of fear, but as a strategic move to maintain their peace. Their power lies not in loud declarations, but in silence, a fortress that protects them from the onslaught of unwanted attention. Their shield? Indifference. They don't give power to things that do not serve their purpose or align with their values. Their philosophy is one of non-engagement. They choose their battles wisely, knowing that not every fight is worth their time or energy. They understand that their strength lies in their ability to stay detached yet observant, to be in the world but not of it. In the end, the Sigma Way is about conserving energy, valuing privacy, and living life on your own terms even if it means dealing with the occasional unwanted attention. Now I want to hear from you all. Share your experiences as Sigma males in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more content on Sigma male traits and behaviors. Let's continue this fascinating discussion together.